University Park transform into a soccer stadium. But today it's back to baseball for the El Paso Chihuahuas. It's opening day at the downtown ballpark. And that's where we find KTSM 9 Sports Director Andy Morgan. Hey Andy, how's the field looking right now? Well, it's looking good. Daniel Natasia, just take a look behind me. It's a thing of beauty, really. And this grounds crew is the best grounds crew in all of baseball, best in the business. And that was before they're pulling double duty between baseball and soccer. Remember, El Paso Locomotive FC played a game here just on Saturday, their first win in club history, I might add. A couple hours after that, the grounds crew was out here working on the field, getting it ready for the Chihuahuas who arrived on Monday. The before and after, it's something else. And Travis Howard, the head groundskeeper here at Southwest University Park, says that every detail is taken into consideration when transforming this field. Being all grass, it's much simpler in my mind. Um, not that it's, you know, not not that it's not hard. You know, we definitely live in a very dry climate where we are constantly managing moisture. Um, but on a baseball field, there are so many edges that we have to maintain, um, whether it be the grass edge to the warning track or the grass edge around home plate, around the mound, and um, just all the clay we have to maintain. Like I said, best in the business. Gates are officially open here at the downtown ballpark. First pitch is at 7. Coming up a little bit later in sports, we're going to talk to not only general manager Brad Taylor as well as the players on what makes opening day just so special. That's coming up a little bit later in sports. For now, we're live at Southwest University Park. Andy Morgan, KTSM 9 News.